Hey y'all, thank you for tuning in to Carolina Food Desert today. It's a fairly overcast day, it's been raining off and on, April 25th. Today we're going to be digging up some grass and planting some heat-loving crops like okra and peppers. I'm going to show y'all how easy it is to transform unproductive grass, grass that takes up space and requires mowing but doesn't provide you with any nutrients or physiological benefits so we're going to be digging up some of that grass and replacing it with some drought tolerant heat loving crops it's very easy quick and affordable to turn a grass lawn growing in a clay based soil into a productive plot and we're going to talk about just how easy that is today so the first thing I'm going to do is just pick out probably a, I don't know, maybe like a two by four foot section. And I'm going to hit the hoe with it for probably 20 or 30 minutes until I don't see any more grass. I'm going to move all the grass into my compost pile, mulch around the edges, add some jungle growth potting mix, some South Carolina compost, some compost from my pile, some mushroom compost. Maybe a little bit of perlite, maybe a little bit of peat moss, but mostly compost. And we're going to turn this clay-based soil with unproductive grass into a productive plot with heat-loving, drought-tolerant crops that are going to provide us with some food in the summer instead of just taking up space and requiring mowing. We have successfully removed a four-foot by two-foot area of grass. Now that we have removed the grass with the hoe, we'll be applying a thick layer of cypress mulch, any type of mulch will do, around the edge. And then we'll be filling this in with a mixture of cow manure, jungle growth potting mix, and some compost. We'll be forming up one or two rows here, and then planting some drought tolerant heat loving crops like okra, peppers, and melons. So we just finished bedding up the uh, plot where we removed the grass about an hour ago. I put a couple little purple jalapeno transplants over here. I'm going to have to go to the store and get some more mulch so I can apply a thicker layer. This is a very similar plot to the one we built today. This one here I think we built two or three weeks ago. And hopefully in two or three weeks, this one here will be in a similar 